Historical lands of Azerbaijan bordered on main Caucasus mountains from north, Gurchi Lake Basin and eastern Anadolu from west, the Caspian Sea from east, and Sultania Zinjan Hamadan is one of the oldest cultural centers where modern civilization lays its foundation. Azerbaijani people created a wealthy and specific culture in this area, historical Azerbaijani grounds. The Azerbaijani area is excessively rich with archaeological monuments, proved as being one of the oldest human dwellings of the world. Procession of ancient history, location on the coast of the Caspian Sea, richness with historical monuments of Azerbaijan, included into map the oldest residents of Europe, existence of nine climate zones or the world's 11 climate zones, hospitality of its people, create wide opportunities for development of tourism there. 12 natural and historical reserves, over 6,000 architectural and cultural monuments are preserved in our country. Ichari Shahar, Maiden Tower, Sheki Khan's Palace, the Muslim of Mormon Khatun, and other cultural monuments registered by UNESCO are already known worldwide. Consistent archaeological expeditions of late periods add new ones to the rows of these monuments. Mysterious and legendary cultural monuments of the world are displayed. Large-scale archaeological excavations nevertheless require development of archaeological tourism, famous in the world in our country as well. Azerbaijan Gadar Dunyada. There is no place in the world as appropriate as Azerbaijan for archaeological tourism, because Azerbaijan was represented by rich monuments almost in all archaeological periods. People had resided there 2, 2.5 million years ago. All archaeological periods have not any stage without rich monuments of Azerbaijan. Archaeological tourism is a type of tourism which assumes special importance amidst tourism kinds and specific in international practice. This kind of tourism is widely spread in the area where archaeological excavations are conducted and visits are arranged to those areas. Taking this as a ground, we can say today it can be estimated as a new stage in formation at fast development of archaeological tourism in Azerbaijan. One of basic targets of Minister of Culture and Tourism, Minister of Culture and Tourism exploring existing historical and cultural monuments in our country and cultural heritage by making them into the tourism product to identify the country, increase its attractiveness and present the monuments in the country to the guests as tourism product. There are more than 6,000 historical and cultural monuments in Azerbaijan. 56 of these monuments are of worldwide importance.
NASA Institute of Archaeology and Ethnography currently conducts archaeological excavations in Goetepe Neolithic dwelling situation in the area of Tobus region. Experts from Tokyo University joined the excavations. The head of International Archaeological Expedition is Farhat Guliev. Analyzed all the materials found there is implemented in broad aspect. The materials revealed in the edifice remnants showed strong development in these grounds in Neolithic period. This find assumes great importance for the world history. It's notable that Goetepe ancient dwelling was reflected in Azerbaijan state program on tourism. Therefore, since this year, 2011, conservation work is being fulfilled on the archaeological monument parallel with the excavations. The expedition head Farhad Guliev said that an article of sickle type found from the excavation site notified lifestyle, culture of husbandry of population resided there 8,000 years ago, therein considered novelty for worldwide science of archaeology. We define that the residents of Goetepe had a very high welfare in 6 millennium before Christ, 8,000 years ago. Goetepe Archaeological Monument remains beyond the context of Azerbaijan. Such monuments are explored in the greater context. Parallelism relations of Near East and Southern Caucasus since they are of the world importance and reflect mainly attributes of primary civilizations. The purpose was to arrange complex explorations, they are taking into consideration very important scientific significance of Goetepe archaeological monument. Because study of the most ancient dwellings are explored on a lot of science and specialities. That's why today's expedition work there is not satisfied with only archaeological excavations. Experts of a plenty of scientific fields work together with us to explore the secrets of archaeological materials found and revealed and restored that period there. First of all, there are archaeozoologists, paleobotanists, and geomorphologists. With the purpose of determination of monuments period, the revealed materials are analyzed by various atom absorption methods abroad. Gala Historic Ethnographical Reservation was created in a historical part of Gala settlement under the order of Cabinet of Ministers of the Azerbaijan Republic in 1988. The space of the reserve covers 156 hectares. There are 215 architectural and archaeological monuments in Gala village and the surrounding regions. The environment, which is dated back to the third millennium before Christ, is preserved here. There are several architectural monuments, five mosques, three bathhouses, nearly 177 houses, agricultural buildings, sepulchres, tombs, kurgans, remnants of castle, of historical importance in Gala, which belong to the period between third millennium before Christ and 20th century. Gala village with its history of 5,000 years have several districts, from those Tarakama, Balaverdi, Ajira Mazan, Chambarakant are preserved today. Open Air Archaeological Ethnographical Museum complex was created in the territory of Gala Historic Ethnographical Reservation in 2008 with initiative and leadership of Haidar Ali Foundation. Kurgan's houses and other architectural monuments belonging to 3rd, 2nd millennium before Christ are set as their originals in this area. A wonderful environment was created to absorb the perils of Azerbaijani history in this museum complex which has a territory of 1.2 hectares. Muzey kompüsü yaradılması konseptisinin esasında iki fikir vardı. Birincisi the conception of establishment of museum complex leaned against two thoughts. First, to preserve archaeology. 
ethnography, architecture, and peculiarities of folklore of Absheron Peninsula and present them to the guests. Second, to create an interactive museum complex. Along with archaeological monuments, we want to set up an interactive tourism here. It means that the visitor not only can explore, familiarize, but also can participate in the acts of archaeological expedition. During the work of the archaeological expedition, the guests can come and take part in the expedition. We included the visual display of any find and implementation of scientific research to interactive tourist drought. Our museum took the first step in the development of interactive tourism in Azerbaijan. There are four workshops there. At the same time, we keep camel up to ship of gala breed. We show the tourists interactively what we use in agriculture and cattle breeding in the Middle Ages. Gabale played significant role in economic, political and cultural life of the country from 4th century before Christ and which name is recalled in written sources since Anno Domini 1st century was the first capital city of Albania. Main residence of Albanian rulers had located there. Gabale, the name of which is mentioned as Kabalaka and Kabala in works of author Pliny the Elder of the 1st century and 2nd century author Claudius Ptolemy is recalled frequently in the 1st Middle Ages and Middle Age sources. City of Gebele consists of three main parts known as Gala, Silber and Chakkale. It was proved that intensive urban life existed in Chakkale, 50 hectare space, which is situated amongst Karachai and Gochalan rivers as a result of the exploration from 4th century before Christ to late 1st century Anno Domine. It was defined that a rich cultural layer of several meter thickness belonged to 1st 10th centuries existed in several part of the city, about 13 hectare spares, and 1st 17th century Gala about 12 hectare space. At least four expeditions annually functioned in Gabala in 70-80s of last century. Since 1990, activity of that expedition stopped and only after 18 year interval, 2008 Gabala Archaeological Expedition of two group of NASA Institute of Archaeology and Ethnography launched explorations in antique and medieval areas of the city, again with support of Azerbaijan-Korean Cultural Exchange Association. Gabal Expedition functions since 2009 with international staff. In initiative of Seba, Korean archaeologists have been carrying out successful explorative work in Seber for three years. A part of the ancient fortress walls revealed in the area of Selbir was covered up in initiative and organization of Seba and urgent conservation work implemented inside that. Reading sources deal with Shamkar city in the period of conquest of Muslim countries. Shamkar city situated on Silk Way grew progressive at the second half of 9th century and 10th century, turned into significant handicraft and trade center. Shamkar city became flourished in 11th-12th century. Development harmony of Shamkar city was spoiled by Mongolian conquest. Mongolians seized the city after 1,235 persistent fight committed large massacre there and put the population to the sword. After this event, the city regressed and couldn't come to itself. The ruins of medieval Shamkir city are located on the left bank of Shamkir Choi and in the north of Mukhtaria village of Shamkir region. The description of the monument proves its processing all features specific for flat medieval cities. Topographic plan of the city taken in 2007 admits to determine the design structure of city-like square.
large-scale archaeological excavations in medieval Shamkir city are implemented as a joint project of NASA, Institute of Archaeology and Ethnography, Regions Development Social Organization and Ministry of Culture and Tourism of the Azerbaijan Republic. Architecture and construction domains entered high development stage in medieval Shamka city. As a result of archaeological excavations, too much construction rests, as well as engineering devices or fortifications, rests of civil edifices and city renovation were displayed. The finds revealed from the archaeological excavations are of various kinds, labor tools, guns, iron, metal products, ceramics, glass products, bone and stone products, decor items and coins. Azerbaijan. Azerbaijan is considered one of the basic centers of appearance of urban civilization in world scale. Formation of urban dwellings of Azerbaijan and their development way are clearly followed. For instance, there were many cities here since old times. Suppose that well-known geographer Strabon cited about 30 cities in Azerbaijan. Azerbaijan had cities like Gabala and Barda in north, the following period Nakhchivan and Ganja, Tabriz and a lot of other notable cities in south. During the Mongolian conquest in 20-30s of 13th century, over 70 cities were fixed in Azerbaijan. While taking a general view of these cities, we can consider that almost half of Azerbaijani population lived in the cities in that time. Generally, if to look through complex to Shamkir archaeology, then it's a unique archaeology. It means it's the unique archaeological monument meeting the highest standards in the world scale. It means it's the unique archaeological